Hey everybody and welcome back to our channel, your go-to place for complex software and tech tutorials made simple. In today's video, we are diving into Open EMR, one of the most powerful open source electronic medical record and practice management solutions out there. Whether you're a clinic owner, healthcare professional, or IT manager, Open EMR offers an affordable, customizable, and HIPAA-compliant solution for managing patient records, scheduling prescriptions, billing, and more. So if you are ready to explore a free yet robust alternative to pricey EHR systems, let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do, visit the official website of Open EMR. And as you may notice, you have four options here. You can click the Give Now to help support ongoing development of Open EMR. Try now if you have an account already with Open EMR with your credentials, find support, and download for free. But the thing is, if you click that, these are going to be the stable production lease. So download the um, Open EMR application depending on your operating system. If you're using, using a Docker, Linux, Windows, and a lot more. So these are going to be the instructions that is provided for you to install the Open EMR application successfully. Or now Open EMR offers a feature rich solution that gives you all these. Okay. So number one is going to be the scheduling. It handles all the appointment management system within Open EMR. So you have a calendar based scheduling for providers and facilities, a custom time slots, recurring appointments and appointment statuses patient appointment notifications or reminders, integration with patient portals so patients can book or reschedule online, and you have a color-coded interface for a quick viewing and filtering by provider or department. Of course, there's going to be the e-prescribing. This is Open EMR's e-prescribing or ERX feature, allowing providers to send descriptions electronically to pharmacies, access patient medication history and interaction alerts, ensures compliance with DEA regulations, for example, for any controlled substances with EPCS. And of course, it reduces prescription errors through drug drug and drug allergy checks. For example, please take note that some e-prescribing features may require integration with third-party services like new crop or short script. Now let's talk about the medical billing. It streamlines the revenue cycle by managing insurance and patient billing workflows because with this, you have the creation and submission of CMS 1500 and UB04 claims, ICD-10, CPT, and HCPCS coding support. You have ERA, EOB management, patient statements, and batch invoicing. You have integration with clearing houses for electronic claims submissions and remittance. And then there is the CMS reporting. It supports compliance and reporting needs, including clinical quality measures or CQM for MACRA, MIPS reporting, meaningful use or MU, and other CMS programs. It offers a customizable reports for practice performance and patient outcomes. Export options for registries and government programs. Okay. And then there is going to be the lab integration. Open EMR allows for seamless integration with labs for ordering lab tests electronically, receiving and displaying structured lab results like LOINC format, supporting HL7 and FHIR protocols for interoperability, integration with major labs like LabCorp and Quest Diagnostics. And then how about the clinical decision rules? This feature offers intelligent evidence-based prompts by analyzing patient data in real time to trigger alerts or suggestions, supporting preventive care, chronic disease management, and medication safety. It allows customization of rules for practice-specific workflows, ensuring guideline adherence and improving patient safety. All the while, you have the advanced security. This is open EMR, including robust security features to ensure data protection. Now, you have a role-based access control for users, audit logging of patient and system activities. You have now a two-factor authentication or 2FA and secure password policies, a HIPAA compliance features for data encryption and user privacy, and of course, support for SSL certificates 
and firewall configurations. You have a multilingual support because OpenEMR is designed to be accessible globally by offering over 30 language packs, including Spanish, French, Chinese, and Arabic. It supports for light right to left languages like Hebrew and Arabic, user interface, localization, and translation tools, and the ability for administrators to customize or add translations. Not only that, Open EMR provides so many benefits because it is an open source software, meaning its source code is publicly available and free to use, modify and distribute. This is a big advantage in the healthcare industry where commercial EMRs can be very expensive. Open EMR allows clinics and hospitals plus developers to avoid licensing fees, customize the system to their specific workflows, and of course, participate in the community by contributing code, features, bug fixes, or documentations. So it encourages users to get involved in development or support, emphasizing its role in transforming healthcare tech. Of course, it offers an on-premise that you can install and run Open EMR on your own local servers within your clinic, hospital, or office. All right, so the benefits of the setup includes full control over the system and data, enhanced security. As data stays within your physical location, it gives you the customization flexibility. However, it might require some IT expertise to manage server infrastructure and of course, regular maintenance updates and backups. But let's not forget that it's also cloud-based because the cloud-hosted version of OpenEMR is where the software is deployed on remote servers and access via the internet. So no need to manage physical servers. It's easier for remote access for telehealth or multi-location clinics. It's ideal for practices that want convenience and don't want to have internal IT support but may come with monthly hosting costs depending on the provider. And if you are looking for real user reviews, first-hand feedback, up-to-date pricing details, and alternative options to open EMR, you can visit trusted software comparison platforms like Captera and of course G2.com. These sites offer valuable insights from actual users to help you make a more informed decision. And with that being said, and that wraps up our dive into Open EMR. So if you're tech savvy or have access to a capable IT team, Open EMR can be a powerful, scalable, and budget-friendly solution for your practice. So whether you're looking for a cloud-based setup or prefer on-premises hosting, Open EMR offers the flexibility healthcare teams that you need. If you found this video helpful, do not forget to like, Subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on our latest software reviews and tutorials. If you have any questions, feedback, or experience using OpenEMR, drop them in the comments below. Would love to hear from you. And as always, thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.